Hi, you know, Jeff submitted an amazing question. How do we get everything that we're doing in our life and with our business all within a 24 hour day? There's only so many hours in the day. And sometimes people look at what we've done over the years that we've been in business and they think, wow, you know, that's so much that you've done. And yes, looking back, it is a lot, but you know, one thing at a time, one thing happened at a time in our schedule, you know, uh, in our project list, in our action plan. And so that's how it goes. We create an action plan that lasts for like five years. We break it down into annual, you know, this year, what are we gonna do? Which this month, what are the steps that we're gonna be able to take on that lead to our five year, you know, ultimate goal? And so we're always taking those actionable steps now, knowing that they lead up to our ultimate goal. So that keeps us quite motivated. There's two of us, my husband and myself. So we're able to split off and share some of the chores. He's good at certain things. He's talented, skilled, already knowledgeable in certain things. And same with myself. And so we split off those activities so that we can find that kind of balance. How we manage our home life, our dogs, our gardens, everything else that goes on behind the scenes of being an entrepreneur. Well, sometimes you have to let certain things go. You have to make a choice. What is a priority this moment, this day, at this time? How, you know, we're always striving forward. We're always working forward. So having a schedule is really important for me. I use Calendly. I use the Google Calendar. Uh, I also use uh, my phone for alerts. And I have my written calendar uh, daytime scheduler as well, where I can scribble in various activities that I'm going to be doing that day, you know, priorities that need to be addressed that day, reminding myself of certain appointments or webinars or uh, events that I'm going to be attending for, you know, my own personal education behind the scenes. So just keeping records, you know, uh, really helps a lot. Learning how to use draft emails uh, to create regular communications that I only have to tweak according to the person that I'm sending it to, but the bulk of the information remains the same. So I don't have to keep writing it over and over and over. Same thing with blurbs and bios and, uh, you know, book descriptions or anything like that. Those are all like pre-written. And then I just tweak it for the audience or the individual that I'm sending it to. It really helps cut down the amount of time that uh, has to be put in behind the scenes and making everything run smoothly. I hope that helped answer your question briefly. There's a lot more behind the scenes to that, but uh, we got to keep these videos brief. So hopefully that answered your question.